Hey guys, your boy Stardust here. Uh, back for another episode of Final Fantasy. All right, so my Cornelia, I did some training off screen, obviously. <laughs> um, so now we're gonna go through the Marsh Cave and get the crown back for that one guy, I believe, the king or whatever. So, fucking Morty did get poisoned, goddammit. Alright. You know, I almost can't stand these battles, I swear. I wish there was a way to, like, turn them off or freaking lower the encounter rate. It's insane. See what I mean? Damn it. I do believe this is the longest we ever walked without a battle. Spoke too soon. You know, I'm really glad some of the later Final Fantasy games I'm gonna record have throttles, speed up functions, because, good god. Alright, we're here. The Marsh Cave. Drink it in. Let it consume you. Just kidding. Let's go. Huh. I thought I was always running. Let's see. Oh, there's no... There's no always run, huh? Okay. Whatever. That sucks. Whatever. Mm -mm -mm -mm. You know, I'm glad it's not too painstaking when I have to, like, cut out all the battles in my video editing software. Shady Gill, okay. Broadsword. I'm already equipped with the broadsword. No, I'm not, okay. Wait. Pretty sure the Mithril Sword is better than the broadsword. Yeah, for sure. Six to go, cool. At least encounter rate's not too bad in this dungeon. I take it back. Dagger. Young dagger dick! Oh, he already has one. Crap. Shouldn't have bought it. Alright. So that way was just for loot. Now we're gonna go to progress. Fucking bat. Hmm. 
Oops, that I... Alright, just checking. I got status condition called dark during that last battle. I was just wondering if it like carried over to outside the battle. And it didn't, so good. I am a little under the weather. Actually, I've been under the weather for the past month. I got sick before New Year's, and I'm still sick now. Some bullshit. Killing me. All these rooms with nothing in them. I forgot to mention, earlier when we went north for the loot right away, uh, in the beginning of the dungeon, uh, whatever loot we picked up there, it's like doubled here like for example we picked up the broadsword and the dagger and two chests full of money um this dungeon has duplicate chests but if you picked it up earlier up north then the chest here when you go south will be empty i totally forgot about that but also i don't i'm not gonna know which room the empty chests are in which is bullshit Maybe all of them are empty. That's where I came from. Oh my god. There we go. Finally. I'm gonna lose my mind doing this fucking let's play for you guys. Probably about another one. I Maybe mean, I could buy some back at the store at the other town. Okay, this is the crown. From what I remember, there's a there's a scripted battle tile like right there in front of the chest. So <laughs> should be good. 
All right, let's do it. <laughs> Two Pisca demons. This is our first uh, boss battle. Boss, quote, unquote, whatever. Well, that was easy. <laughs> Hit pretty hard though. Oh man. Nice. All right. So that's it for this dungeon. These doors, this whole bottom row can't be open unless I have the Mystic Key. Uh, I think I'm gonna do a jump cut to where I go and deliver the crown to that king. You guys remember where that is. I'm gonna do a jump cut. Can I do a jump cut? I'm gonna do a jump cut anyway. All right, here we are. Uh, where's the throne room? Right here. Oh no! What an asshole. Alright, so this might be our first true boss battle. No quotes. Uh, I wonder if... I'll just heal for now. That one's slightly hurt. Uh, I'll just let the attackers do their thing. No! Oh my god, I can't believe that worked. God damn it. I might be fucked. Stop poking me. Oh, that was easy. Sorry, Emily, you don't get any experience this round. 750. Eh, it's okay, man, I guess. Oh, yeah. Alright, so. With the crystal lion hand. Oh, she's still dead. Crap. Okay, I'm gonna have to get back to town and revive her or something. Um, with the crystal lion hand, we have to go back to Matoya's cave and get. That's the old witch. Remember, she's complaining about not seeing without her crystal eye. Let's go back and give her her eye. So, you guys know what that is? I'm, uh, I'm gonna do another jump cut to that area right now. Alright, cool. Uh, we made it back here. Jolt Tonic. So, this could be used on the Prince of Elfheim. Nothing else, fine. I didn't just totally save your sight or anything. Okay. One more jump cut, back to Elfheim. And here we are, back at the Elven Castle. Let's go give that prince the jolt tonic. Wake his ass up. Oh shit, he's up. Hmm. 
Mr. Key. Sweet. Now we can open a bunch of shit that we couldn't open before. Let's start with the castle. Mithril hammer. That's gonna be good for Emily. Bronze gloves. shop there we go vendor okay I'm gonna buy one more copper armlet for VV you guys i'm gonna end this episode here next time we're gonna start off with uh going around and opening the other places with the mystic key that we can loot and then we'll continue with the story from there because one of the doors behind one of the mystic key doors has a key item behind it that we need to progress anyway so uh yeah until then see you guys next time later